Hinduism is based on a trinity of gods, Lord Brahma, the creator, Lord Vishnu, the preserver, and Lord Shiva, the destroyer. Whenever the world is threatened with evil, chaos, and destructive forces, Lord Vishnu descends to earth in different avatars to restore the worldly order. Dash avatar are his ten primary incarnations. The first of them is the fish or matsya avatar. Let's see why. Once Lord Brahma finished his day's work of creation and was ready to sleep, his one day, made of billions of earth years, is the time period between creation and destruction of the universe, called a kalpa. Out of exhaustion, he yawned and unknowingly let the Veda slip out of his mouth. A demon called Hayagriv who wanted to stop the human race from getting the benefits of the Vedas, took this chance and stole them. Lord Vishnu saw that and had to act quickly to retrieve them before the eminent dissolution of the world at the end of that kalpa. As he wondered, he saw Satyavrat, his ardent devotee and a righteous king. He appeared in the king's hands as a tiny fish and asked for his protection from bigger creatures in the river. The kind-hearted Satyavrat put the fish in his kamandal. But within hours the fish outgrew the kamandal and Satyavrat had to move it to a larger vessel. But the fish outgrew it again and so he had to move it to a pond, then a lake and finally the ocean. But the fish still kept growing. The king realized that this could only be Lord Vishnu and submitted himself. Lord Vishnu appeared and told him that in seven days the world will be submerged by the ocean, destroying all creation. He asked Satyavrat to collect herbs, seeds, animals, the Saptarishis and Vasuki, the king of the serpents, and wait for the boat that he will send. With that, the fish set off in the mission of finding Hayagriv, who was hiding under the ocean with the Vedas. Lord Vishnu found him, killed him and retrieved the Vedas. Seven days later, the rain poured down in torrents and the ocean began to rise, slowly swallowing the lands. The boat arrived as promised and Satyavrat and his party boarded it. As the boat was tossed about by the ocean's turbulence, the fish appeared again and asked him to tie the boat to its horn using Vasuki as a rope and steered them safely. Throughout the night of Brahma, Lord Vishnu taught Satyavrat and the Saptarishis the highest form of truth which has come down to us as the Matsya Purana. He made Satyavrat the Manu of the next Kalpa, meaning the first human from whom all mankind would descend, thus preserving the divine knowledge and saving mankind.